Hi, my name is François Tarlier and welcome to this quick tip for aetatsplus.com about announcing your workflow. And in this episode, we'll talk about how you can set up shortcuts uh, in After Effects. So natively, you cannot change or set any shortcuts, but some guys over at Adobe made a script, which is part of this package, additional scripts for After Effects, CS5, CS4, there's also a CS3 uh, somewhere, I'll give the link on the post. One of the scripts is called Key Add App. It's an editing keyboard shortcut, which will let you set your shortcuts for some commands in After Effects. So all you have to do is download it and extract it into your script UI panels. Uh, mine is just here and yeah, it's the folder inside your After Effects installed. So then in After Effects, you'll find it into window and well, mine is outside the record zone, but uh, it's there called kiedup.gsx. So you click on it and a window will open with all the different categories and command where you, which you can set some shortcuts. So if you're like me, having some kind of French keyboard, uh, you might have noticed some shortcuts doesn't work. For instance, uh, to set the in point or out point of a layer, I believe it's alt open brackets. Uh, on uh, the default shortcuts and alt close bracket for the alt point. But mine uh, doesn't work because to do the, the bracket on my keyboard, I have to push another keystroke. So I'll change that by using the script. So I'll start it and I'll go to the timeline navigation and find, yeah, trim layer endpoint to current time and it's alt uh, open bracket, so I'll do it. Alt, let's see, B. I'll check if this is not used. Alt B is not used, so I'll be able to assign it. And I'll do the same for the out point. And I'll choose the E letter for and check if it's not used. Okay, it is not. Update and click OK. So now it asks me to restart After Effects. I'll pause the video and try it after that. So we are back in After Effects. I'll try my shortcut now. Uh, let's go at one minute and I'll press Alt B for the endpoint. Oops, select the layer, Alt B. And here we go, now the, the shortcut works. I'll try the output point to Alt E and now well, I got, uh, I'm able to, to use those comments now with shortcuts. So I would tell you to go through all the comments you need. The, the limitation to this script is uh, you cannot add a new command or whatever. But another thing you can do with it, which I like a lot, is assigning, let's see, uh, shortcuts for your scripts. Uh, each script you have installed uh, in your After Effects. So let's see, let's start it, go to general. And if you scroll down a little bit, you'll see the run script number one, run script number two, run script number three. And so you can assign a shortcut for it to, to call it later. Uh, the good thing is I, I just renamed all my uh, scripts in, in, in my folder, putting a number so I can order them and make sure it's not gonna change uh, or whatever. So yeah, that's it. I uh, hope it's going to be helpful for you. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.